What's going on everybody? Welcome back to a breaking news story and Rafa Nadal is officially out of the US Open. We still have some players that are playing because it's officially still on. Remember Madrid also uh, just got cancelled. So interesting to see that Rafa would pull out of the US Open considering he doesn't have really a tight schedule with Madrid being straight after uh, you know the US Open final. It got cancelled. But Rafa's not going to play. We'll see Rafa in Rome, potentially, or the French Open. Depends on uh, what happens with those tournaments. But he is officially out of the US Open. The players that are in the US Open, though, there's very interesting names. Djokovic, he is playing the US Open, apparently, because he is playing in Cincinnati in the doubles and the singles. So he's very likely to play. Team Medvedev, Tsitsipas, Zverev, Berrettini, and Goffin are all the players that are confirmed in the top 10 to be playing. Nadal's out. Federer is not playing with injury, and Monfils is out as well, so I don't know why he's not playing if he's confirmed, but uh, he's not on the list of entrants into the US Open. So this is what Rafa had to write on Twitter overnight. He's written a couple of tweets. Uh, he said, after many thoughts, I've decided not to play this year's US Open. The situation is very complicated worldwide. The COVID cases are increasing. It looks like we still don't have uh, control of it. So he says, all, and then he goes on to say, all my respects to the USTA, the US Open organizers, and the ATP for trying to put events together. So the world number one, sorry, the world number two is out, and the defending champion is out. Now, what's that going to mean? Does that mean the US Open's not going to be as good? Well, I don't think so, because Djokovic is playing. If Djokovic wasn't playing, then maybe the US Open wouldn't be as competitive as we want, and it wouldn't be as interesting as we want but you know Nadal's pulled out of tournaments with injury before so I don't think this is a, a massive it's a massive blow for the tournament of course but I don't think it's a really big deal because we still have Djokovic there uh, team of course is there as well you know two-time Grand Slam finalist in the last 12 months so we still have some massive names there we just don't have one of the best players in the world it means that Rafa's gonna have to play the French Open to get that 20 20th Grand Slam title. So officially, Rafa Nadal, after much speculation over the last, you know, weeks and months on this channel, he's officially out. He's pulled out of the US Open.